guys i am off work and on the way home i need to run to walmart before i go to school today but i also need to study for a test so i'm thinking about just pushing walmart back until tomorrow and then going home and studying for this dang test and i'm mad because i forgot to turn in my quiz yesterday and it was still open for me to submit it so i did submit it eventually but i don't know if she's actually going to accept it and it was one of those things where it was like um just turn in like a screenshot that you took the quiz you can take it as many times as you want just submit your highest grade now i've only taken it one time and i got an 84 on it now my school that's not good because the 84 is four points off of an f so if she does take any points off of it, it's going to go from an 84 to whatever. So I'm about to go home and take another quiz, try to get 100 on it, and just submit that one and just let her take off whatever points she want to take off for it being late. Because if I have 100 points and she take off 10, I'll be okay with a 90. But I have an 84 now and she take off 10 points, then that'll be a 74, which would have I would have a failing grade in... The books which is gonna obviously bring my grade down um i mean anything is better than a zero but yeah that just kind of really irritated me because i did all that cleaning up and hair and cooking and all that stuff yesterday and i totally forgot about having to do the quiz but i mean i guess that's what happens when you have 100 things to do at one time but what i need to do is just start dedicating actual time to sit down and do my schoolwork, um, I guess I would just have to make sure I'm cleaning my room. Like that has to be the main thing that's clean because I say to myself like, oh, I can't focus and I can't study when there's like clutter around me. But if I keep my room be cluttered or clean, then I won't have to worry about, you know, being all jittery and stuff when it is time for me to study. Um, so yeah, I don't, I don't know. That just really, better i have this test today that i have not quite studied for i'm okay with it um on a scale of one to ten i think i'm at a cool six i'm about to go study right now so that should bring me up to like an eight i i won't say i'm at a hundred percent for nothing ever um but yeah so i'll catch y'all i'll hit y'all in a second I made it home, I'm in my robe, I took my work clothes off. I am currently studying for my test today. Got my whiteboard beside me and yeah, I'm just about to figure out what I don't know and what I do know. But there was a specific piece of information that I said I needed, I need to make sure I go over this. And so that's what I'm doing now. Um, and it's the stages of psychological development from Erickson theory, the Freud theory, Piaget theory and there's another person um, on theory too but they're not on this paper but it's in the book so um yeah I am going to do that and I guess y'all can watch me discouraged and then like not listening throughout the lecture and I knew I need to listen through the lecture because a lot of the stuff that she 
talked about last section for the unit test that we took today was actually on the test i know that sounds crazy y'all but y'all don't know the type of teachers we had but um so yeah this teacher actually lectures which i love and so i mean as long as you're listening and lecture taking notes going back and reading the chapter then you should be fine i checked my grade and i got a Say so, yay, mommy got an ID. Say mommy got an ID. Can you clap for me? Yeah. Say so, yay. Say so, yay. Clap. Say hi guys. Hi guys. <laughs> hmm? Hmm? No, you can't have no go. Hi. Hmm. Uh -huh. Hi. Hi. I'm about to eat, take a shower, do a facial, and lay down. I deserve it. Doing some skincare. All right. Trying to get. I have a blackhead right here. I have a something right here. I have a lot of lot of stuff going on. So, so I'm getting myself together. Yeah. Using my skin square products. This is the strawberry spearmint mask. But yeah. Good night. I'm about to eat. Yeah. Wash this mask off. Shut up, I already took a shower by the way. Hi y'all, I'm at school because she has a fever, so I'm picking her up. She has all these cute little things in the lobby. It smells good in here. So I picked Zaya up from school. I went and got what I needed for dinner. Came home, cooked, went and got Zoe. Now I'm about to clean up. I am gonna probably try to go grocery shopping tomorrow. Zaya is not gonna go to school tomorrow. Um, so I don't have to get up at 5 a.m. I don't think I'm going to go to work tomorrow because she can't go to school she was sent home today because she had a fever so she has to be fever free for 24 hours tomorrow's friday so obviously she's not gonna be fever free for 24 hours in time for her to go to school tomorrow so i am not to clean up i guess i'll go shop grocery shopping in the morning and yeah i feel like every time i come on here I am always talking about that I'm about to clean up. And I swear I'll be cleaning up, y'all. I swear I do. But it seems like I clean up every freaking day. Like, literally. Um, I'm making beef stew. And it's almost done. I've got to make the rice. And I don't know what else we're going to eat with it. Maybe like some bread or something. Um, but yeah, that's all for now. I don't really have too much to... Talk it out. Baby, I'm talking crazy. I need you right in my space.
Okay. Mama, guys. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. Okay. Hi, all. I have not been on here that much this week, but I just wanted to come on here and tell y'all. Baby, I got a 98 on my exam today. Period. Cool. Okay. All right. Bye. Say hi, guys. Hi, guys. <laughs> yeah, you can do that. Uh huh. What? <laughs> you ready? You ready to go to daycare? Yeah. You gonna have a good day? Yeah. You gonna be a good girl? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. Okay. I'm sure, 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 sure. You got a sister? Yeah. <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Say yay! Hey, yay. Hey. I just got word that there's free lunch. So that's where I'm going. To get some free lunch. I do want to just go up here and just get it situated so that I don't have to worry about that. And I have no excuse now not to go to the gym. What you, what's next? Y'all don't got no clothes? I can hit up Ross right quick and go get me some workout clothes. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm about to do. Okay, so um, Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays, they close at 9 p.m. And Mondays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays, they close at 7 p.m. So you can go to the gym so what this this location closes at what time? So um, Saturday, Sunday, we close. We open at seven a.m. Uh -huh. Close at seven p.m. Uh -huh. Monday through Thursday, we open at five a.m. and close at one p.m. Okay. And Friday, we open at five a.m. Close at nine p.m. Okay. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah, I think I need the black card because I probably go between here, this location, and another location. So. Yeah, we can for it. I gotta get. I'm signing up for the gym, y'all. See me. Y'all see me. Signing up. Doing my big one. Not too much on me. I ain't gonna be here every day, but y'all, you feel me? I'm just I'm making the necessary, the necessary steps. Y'all, look at my keys. My boyfriend brings me back. Oh, trinkets. Because y'all know he drives trucks, so he brings me back. Trinkets when he's on the road. He got me this. This is number one. Mom, he got this. What's the? He got this in y'all. He got this. That's cute. He got this in Texas. This in Texas. Spoiled. Zoe, that's my baby name. That's all. Then after that, he started getting me shot glasses. So quickly. Guys, 
I am from the bus stop. We are inside of Gabe's. <laughs> and we're trying to find, there was this like cute little cup. I think I showed it in another clip, but there's this cute little cup back here. It was like boo, mama boo and mini boo or something like that. So I'm trying to see if they have it. Cause she, she gotta get that angle. Asked me to <laughs> yeah, coffee cup, so yeah. <laughs> hey guys, I'm back in the house. I got dinner started. Well, I'm starting dinner now and it's a little late, but I also did Zoe's hair, so not too much for me. We are doing chicken fajitas tonight. So I'm making the chicken breast. I got four chicken breasts. I'm gonna take two and a half and make the fajita with, and then the other one and a half I'm gonna use to um, meal prep my salad for the week. Y'all, so I went to the gym earlier uh, and I did not actually have to make an account. Uh, however he did it, I could just use his. So that's what I'm gonna do. But my sister gets off at nine. They close at 11, so I'm gonna go at nine to work out. Well, when she gets off, so it'll probably be like 9, 30, 10 um, to work out. The kids will be in the bed. And then I will come back in here and study. I know that sounds very tiring. Like, girl, how you about to do all that and study? But guess what? We gonna do it. Cause we have no other choice but to do it. So. I'm making these chicken breasts. They kind of fat, so I don't know how long they're gonna take to cook. The girls are in the tub. I don't know if y'all can hear them in the background arguing, but they're in the tub. I'm about to go wash them up and lotion them down and get them out so they can so they can wind down and get ready for bed. We might do like a movie tonight. Not sure. It just really depends on what time I get finished cooking. But to be honest, the rice is cooking, the chicken is cooking. The only thing I have to do is make the black beans and then we're good. So I might try to watch a movie with them. Not 100% sure, it just really depends on how they act. They've been arguing. So, and Zoe's been moody because I was doing her hair. So who knows what's about to happen. I will hit y'all back in a second. I'm gonna take my makeup off, obviously, when I get to the gym. Just got out of class. I just I fit, we took a test today, and I have not checked my grade. Um, nervous. I'm gonna check it with y'all. Okay, so y'all gonna see my roll. Hold on. Y'all gonna see my raw reaction of me checking my grade because I don't I don't like checking my grade in class because I just feel like. If I didn't do well, I'm not gonna focus on the lecture. That's what happened last time, which is kind of why I was like behind when I took my test today because I wasn't really listening last lecture because I was kind of disappointed with my grade. So I'm gonna check my grade. <laughs> I'm gonna check my grade. Let's see. I'm gonna check my grade. Didn't do. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <sighs> okay, I didn't do as... <laughs> I got a 90. I didn't do as bad as I thought, y'all. I was so freaking scared. Okay, I didn't do... I didn't do bad, okay, for me not to have study. And I think next test is, test is gonna be a lot easier. Quiz and test is gonna be a lot easier. So, yeah, I got a 90, y'all. I got a nine. So it only took my, I had a 94 in the class. It took me down to a 93, which is fine. I feel like I'm gonna pass this class with the A. I hope I do. But if not, I'm okay with just passing, you know? Um, but yeah, that's all for tonight. 
um i'll see y'all tomorrow well actually i was gonna try to go to the gym but it's kind of late so i think i'm gonna just push you back to just going in the morning because we got out of class it's 9 44 and i gotta pick the girls up by 10 30. we got out of class late today because my uh teacher there was a teacher that's i guess about to start teaching at my school she was observing the teacher that we had so she you know didn't do her regular regular schmegler um so she let us out like an hour late but you see the hair there that's fine with me i'm gonna go home get the girls and i might come back on here but if i don't i'll see y'all tomorrow have a good night